This channel's content is strictly for educational and informational purpose and does not endorse or promote any form of violence, harm, illegal activities, self-injuries and communal disharmony. It's okay, sir. Fine, fine. Sir, there is one complaint, uh, one lady that she has committed against you. You must have heard of that thing and you gave one audio record. But uh, what is your take on this whole issue, sir? On that issue, I have said enough. Now, I don't want to repeat that because I am the accused. But I have something to appeal to you. You know, governor is supposed to stay away from politics. Governor is an apolitical post. To the best of my conscience, I have tried to be above politics. Ask any political party. They all had access to me. And publicly, they've acknowledged that I was accessible to all of them, including the leaders of the ruling party. Now, I'm very sorry that the chief minister has dragged me into politics, especially at a time when the elections are going on. I have something to appeal to my brothers and sisters of Bengal through you. Number one, I told a lot of good words about the individual Mamata Banerjee. I stick to that. I spoke good words about the Chief Minister, whom I always hold as my esteemed constitutional colleague. I stick to that. When questions were asked to me repeatedly to speak about the politician Mamata Banerjee, I always took the stand. Her politics is not my cup of tea. I refuse to comment on that. Now, because of the humiliating remarks which she has made against me, against truth, I am forced to tell you, my media friends, and through you, to the brothers and sisters of Bengal, Mamata Banerjee, as a politician, Mamata's politics is dirty. Still, I pray God. Save her. But that is a difficult responsibility even for God. I will not accept. I will never accept this Didi Giri on the distinguished office of the governor. That's all I have to say. Thank you. Bangla Rawaj, Bangali Rabek, Z Chubbish Gonta.